citizens of Zone TV. Pastor Hello. Jonathan here with my buddy, Miss Alex. Hi. And you may have noticed we have some uh, delicious treats, yeah. pastries, if you will, stacked up, but not just any pastries, mm. the uh, the famous Pop-Tarts. Um, now, what do you know about Pop-Tarts, Miss Alex? I know a lot about Pop-Tarts, okay? It's not just for breakfast. Really? You can have them as a nice little treat, a little snack. You can put them in the fridge, depending on the flavor, like the more chocolatey ones are good cold. The toaster, of course, that really makes it like a dessert. And then of course, you know, just right out of out of the foil itself. My so. gosh, I mean this in the nicest way. You are a Pop-Tart nerd. Yeah. And you know everything about them. M not everything, but well, what we I don't really know, like them. What we don't know is which one is the very best. What is, which is the very tippy top pop? Oh. Um, and we're gonna figure that out for you. We're gonna do the hard work of tasting all of these Pop Tarts mm -hmm. and letting you know which ones are and which ones are yeah. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. We're gonna start with a flavor we all maybe love, maybe not. Cherry. Not bad. It doesn't really taste like much. Like, I'm. <laughs> not bad, not great. No, I mean. Really the best part about this is the presentation. It yeah, looks, it's it really looks... nice. It's not gross like I thought it would be, and that's good. You thought it would be gross, okay. Because I don't like cherry, but. Gotcha. Well, I'm gonna give this a five out of 10, and I'm gonna say, sure, why not? I'm not gonna grab it the first thing out of the pantry, but um, if it, you know, if somebody gave one to me, I wouldn't be upset. Yeah, I also am gonna give it a five. Just it's a neutral rating. Yeah. Oh my, this that looks like an egg exploded. <laughs> That's some mustard right there. On this. <laughs> That's nasty. It smells bad. I'm just gonna say it smells not good. Oh, woof. All right, here but we But I'm go. here for you. This is for you guys. Okay. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I see what they're trying to do here. But I think this is a failure. I, I think this is a big fail. Um, you might say epic fail. What ruins it is the stink. Like, <laughs> once you take a bite and your nose then just like, yeah. Gets a little more. I think what ruins it is the bad smell and bad taste. And it's all mushed on there. Like why, this one is beautiful. Yeah. You know, like not a lot of flavor, but beautiful. And this one's just kind of. So we're ranking this on presentation and taste. I say this is a <laughs> terrible presentation and the taste is no good. Um, I'm gonna give this a two out of 10. That's kind, I'm gonna give it a one. Uh -oh. It just failed in a lot of ways for yeah. me, so. Okay. Waffle, Pop-Tart. Maybe not a great idea. No. Hmm. Ooh, that is zingy. <laughs> yeah. I'm loving this. Um, I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna give this a nine out of ten. You know. Oh. Like I would have to literally rock it out of my seat into the stratosphere, into space, wow. towards Jupiter for it to be a ten. I'm not quite there, but I'm close. And that includes your presentation. Presentation's great, but okay. the taste, the taste is what really gets me on this. It's zingy. I'm gonna, <laughs> I said that before. I'm gonna give it a seven. Yeah, I mean, it's. Come on. It's good, but I don't feel the way that you What do you feel? want out of a Pop-Tart? No, yeah. Well, that's a zingy nine to me. Hmm. Wow. Now this is good. Is it blueberry good? No but it's good. I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna give this a seven. That's a seven for me. I don't love this one, I don't think. No? Mm. Not a fan? Mm. Lower than a five? Well, that was zingy. zingy. And they're both raspberry, but this is just blue. Oh. But this one was too much. Okay. For me. And you know what? If we are talking a little bit about presentation. Boring? Boring. Okay. It just feels like it was an afterthought. And due to that, I am gonna give it a four. Whoa. Mm. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, and it's soft. Yeah. You gotta be kidding me. Pop tart. Mm. You nailed it. You nailed. This is. Man, I feel like I, I gave the blueberry a nine. Mm -hmm. I can't go any higher than a ten. Oh, are you gonna give it a ten? You are. I can't. The only, the only, the only thing is. Sell me on this presentation. I mean, you know, you don't got any cream, you don't got any, it's just. No, but here's the thing. It's all about, this one is all about the texture. It's soft, you know, like a cookie. I know. Right out of the oven, soft. I'll give it another nine. Okay, I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give it a nine as well. Mm -hmm. I, there's a lot of chocolate chips, mm -hmm. you know, they're not, you know, skipping out on the chocolate chips. Mm-hmm. 
I forgot about how much I like these. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna give this, oh yeah, I'm going. I'm going to the full 10. Mm -hmm. The full 10 for the s'more Pop-Tart. This is the most delicious Pop-Tart yet invented by human hands. I would have to agree, and this might be biased because I, I came into this kind of knowing it's my favorite, but I love it. And the presentation of it, it's given, it, it's a nice campfire. Yes, this is gonna will, taste classic. good. Classic. This is gonna taste good out of a toaster. This is gonna taste good in the fridge. Oh, this is yeah. gonna taste good in your back pocket after you sat on it and it's crumbly and mushy. I don't care, it's gonna taste good. Mm -hmm. I think we have a winner, and her name is S'mores Pop-Tart. Clear winner. Ding, 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 s'more Pop-Tart, best one in town. You know, hey, listen, I hope you cheered for your favorite, <laughs> and I hope you have a chance to try this s'more Pop-Tart, mm -hmm. if you haven't already, because wow, it's gonna blow your socks off. <laughs> All right, until next time. Bye. bye.